All right. Hello, hello, hello again. Hello again. It's January 15th, 2014. We've made it this far so far. How's it feel? How's it feel? Feels pretty good to me. I'm thankful. Guess why? I'm breathing. I'm talking. I'm living. First off, real quick, um, just want to pay a moment of silence to a good friend of mine. His mother passed away the past couple of days. And also to the people who have also passed that we don't know. For those of you out there, the lost family members as well, just uh, have a moment of silence. Thank you. appreciate that. I was thinking about a lot of different things of what I was going to make my video for. I'm coming to you like the rent and the paychecks on the 1st and the 15th. That's how we're going to hit this video on the syllabus.org. This is Darren Price once again. If you missed the first video, uh, go ahead and send you the other link. The link is on YouTube. It's also on Facebook on the syllabus.org. You can go ahead and go to YouTube also. Just type in my name or type in Got Motivation or What Motivates Me. Just type it in. This will be my second video I'm coming to you twice a month, just like the rent and the money. So, <laughs> got to bring it to you the truth. But some things been going on. As you see, just look around the world today. It's a nice, sunny, sunny, sunny day where I'm at. It's cold, but it's sunny. You know, we're living. Everything's okay no matter what. But the thing I want to talk about today is being a star. You know, a star. What is a star to you? What is, what is a star? What does it do for you? Are you a star? Do you believe that you're a star? Define a star to yourself. Just take one second, think about it. What, what's a star? My definition of a star is very, plenty of variations, you know, in the mental, in the sense, the physical. But, you know, you have to picture it two different ways, so we'll break that down real quick. I know we got a little bit of jazz music going on. Cut that down just for a little bit, just to keep it going. Keep you pumped up a little bit. A star. Doing everything needed without complaining or arguing. Aligning yourself to be the best that you can be by surrounding yourself with positive peers and mentors, becoming a role model for others that are waiting to follow into your footsteps, accepting positive criticism that focus on making you a better person to society, to your family, to your peers, and to yourself. That's what a star is, all those qualities and facets shine like stars in the universe as you proceed forward in life we gotta move forward that's what a star does you know that's that's kind of a couple of definitions doing everything needed without complaining or arguing that's a star the star is aligning yourself to be the best that you can by surrounding yourself with positive peers and mentors We'll bring it to a real star perspective in a second. Becoming a role model for others that are waiting to follow your footsteps. Those are your kids. Accepting positive criticism that focus on making you a better person to society, your family, your peers, and to yourself. <laughs> Shine like stars in the universe as you proceed forward in life. So imagine a star, right? A star shines bright. There's many talks, phrases. Shine bright like a diamond, whatever you want to call it. A star. But that's bright. A star is bright, right? There's plenty of stars out there. And I got to relate this to my good friend whose mother passed away. Rest in peace. Then my man, uh, Vaughn, your mother's a star. This to everybody that's passed away. Those people are stars. We're stars down here struggling to shine bright as we can be. As the ones that we see up in the sky every night. 
the ones that shooting stars. You know, those are so bright. Those are angels. Those are our people. Those are people who passed away. You know, six cents. Matrix, we call it. It has some truth to it. But think about it. It's in the sense of a star. A star is so bright and it just mingles amongst others at like itself. So that's your peers and, and mentors. And the stars, they all shine bright, but they keep their space from each other because they have their own light. You know, the moon is a star, the earth is a star to another star, planet, whatever you want to call it, but it's bright. It shines. But how does it shine? How does it communicate? Why is it shining? Stars are in groups. Galaxies, atmospheres, we call it. So picture yourself being a star, but just bring it down some. Think about it. You're a star. Everybody's a star. The ones that are up there, that's what we're trying to get to. Is the, is the stars that we don't have to worry about. We shine bright forever no matter what. With no problem. That's what shining like stars are. Those are definitions of shining like stars. So those stars are up there right now. And we need to be those stars. We need to be those stars that, that, that do everything <laughs> without complaining or arguing. When you do that, your light just kind of gets dimmer and dimmer and dimmer. You know, so we're not aligning ourselves to be the best that we can. You know, by surrounding ourselves with positive peers and mentors. So then our light gets a little bit smaller. You know, <laughs> we try to become role models for others that are waiting to follow in our footsteps. So how are we leading our kids? How are we leading our future? How are we leading our next generation? As a star, the star gets smaller and smaller. And those other stars around you, remember in that galaxy. You know, those are your mentors and peers, right? They're all stars too, so then they become dimmer and dimmer. So they follow suit, right? Right? So that's when things go wrong, awry, astray. Right? So that's what we're talking about. Remember the phrase of a star? So, you know, we got to move on as a star. A bright star accepts positive criticism that focuses on making you a better person to society, to your family, to your peers, and to yourself. So you being that star, as I said, the dimmer you get, the dimmer the people are around you. Or if you have those dim people around you, you have to separate yourself and be that brighter star and keep going higher and higher and higher. You may have to leave and go to a different galaxy, so to speak, quote unquote. Sometimes you got to think outside the box. I had a friend just the other day tell me, I got to think outside the box. You know what? There is no box. Throw the box away. There is no, think outside the box. That's cliche. There is no box. Think outside the box. Throw the box away. There is no box. If you're in a box, stars aren't in boxes. Stars don't circulate around boxes. Stars just go. Right? So, we got to shine like stars in the universe as you proceed forward in life. We're a star going forward in life. But we got to do it together. We got to do it the right way. We gotta surround ourselves with positivity. We gotta gain it. We gotta get it. We have to show it to display it. That's how we get it, and it becomes more and more and more. For for those that read the Bible, as Philippians Philippians chapter two verse twelve through eighteen clearly states, shining as stars. Therefore, my dear friends, as you have always obeyed, not only in my presence. But now much more in my absence, continue to work out your salvation with fear and trembling. For it is God who works in you to will and to act according to his good purpose. Be blessed. But take it however you want to take it. I'm just giving you different examples and I'm bringing it to you how it was brought to me. And, and I believe. I mean... I definitely believe I have no problem saying that but again I'm a sinner just like you I'm not trying to judge you just trying to help you I'm here for a reason I'm trying to tell you something I'm trying to tell myself something apparently too so get right I got one for you today 
Repeat after me. I got one for you today. God has brought me out for a reason. I survived because he has a plan for me. Any bad relationships, suicidal thoughts, bad credit, repossessions, death of my loved ones, negative thoughts mean nothing because I am blessed. I release and let go of all past hurts, misunderstandings and grudges because I am blessed. I recognize them as the illusions that they are, for God is all there is, at least it is to me, or your most high. All else is a lie, and besides, <laughs> I'm blessed. <laughs> hey, so until then, I hope you enjoy the text messages you've been getting every day in the post on the syllabus.org on Facebook. I appreciate the comments that you get and responses have been very well and it's what keeps me going so you know your responses keep me going you allowing me to share you know what I feel and express myself you know and if I'm making a positive impact I'm great with that if I'm making a negative impact on somebody I mean whatever you know I mean I'm here for a reason and I'm doing me because I'm here for a purpose everybody's here for their own purpose and I thank everybody for the good comments and I thank for the thank you for the bad comments that I don't even hear. But like I say sometimes somebody's always talking about you no matter what you do. But I'm gonna try my best to do my best every day. And uh there's no such thing as perfect unless you a star up there. So one day we'll get there. The plan has already been laid out, but we don't know it yet. Uh it's just our duty to try and do our best, man. Try our best to do our best every day. Never gonna be perfect, but just try to try to, you know, acknowledge the fact that there's somebody higher and above you. Number one, have a little faith in it, and have faith in yourself. And, you, and things that get better, you gotta believe, man. But it's all, not always about you. You gotta share it. You gotta give it to receive it. Things that get better around you, growth. You know, I wish, I faith, I prayer for you. You know, I pray for everybody. Y'all have a great second half of the month i see you next on youtube facebook twitter google my urls will be posted up shortly but most of you already know me darren price syllabus.org hit me up i'm also uniqueness unlimited modeling productions on facebook also paris price management consultants i'm the business partner with william paris who's the director of uniqueness unlimited modeling productions See you soon. Thank you very much. God bless. Darren Price, thesyllabus.org. Y'all have a great, blessed day, month, life, and make somebody else happy. You'll feel good.